Welcome back guys to another video and today I'm going to show you profits compared with NiceHash and Zpool. So I was mining on Zpool for the last 48 hours with my rigs and I have 5 GTX 1060 3GB versions, 3 GTX 180 8GB and 1 GTX 180 Ti. So I was mining for 48 hours on Zpool uh, for 24-7. And I was automatically converting everything that I mined uh, directly into Bitcoin. So you can see that I was mostly mining Lira 2 Revision 2 for the last few hours that I was mining. And that is because Lira 2 Revision 2 is insanely profitable right now. And this is mostly because of 51% attack that is happening on some Lira 2 Revision 2 powered coin. So I think it's Mona coin or something like that. But I'm not 100% sure and I cannot confirm you that information. So, you can see that I made 2.8 milli bitcoins for 48 hours, and this is about $22 by today's rates of $7,500 per one bitcoin. So, let's see how much money would I make if I would just be running my rigs on NiceHash. So, if you go to NiceHash Profitability Calculator, you can choose 3 GTX 1080 over here, and then press Calculate, you would see how much would I make with 1 GTX 1080, I would make $2.69, then you can choose 1060s and 180 Ti, and you can combine all of that to see profits. So, I already did that over here, and I would be making $16.82 per 24 hours by using only NiceHash. So, for 48 hours, that means that I would make a little bit more than $33.5 in the last 48 hours. So NiceHash actually did really great, and you can see that profitability is rising almost every single day in the last few days, and it went from about 25,000 satoshis per day per one GPU to about 44,000 satoshis. So we have seen almost 100% increase in profitability for GTX 180, and this is the case for, for almost every other GPU on the market. So, $22 compared to $33 is more than 50% difference, and uh, that means that NiceHash is still the best way to go. It is the easiest to set up, and you don't have to do almost anything else than just click one button, start mining, and you will actually have the best profits. Now, this might not be the case if you want to mine some coins that are new and that just came to the market and those coins could be really, really profitable. If some miner, maybe like awesome miner, decides to add those coins, you could be actually making a lot more money. But then you have to spend a lot of your time researching the coins and looking what should you mine and go to whatdomain.com and many other sites and maybe have a few different miners installed, uh, switch from one, one miner to another and all of those things. Because as we have seen in the last few videos where I compared uh, different kind of miners, automatic mining switching doesn't actually work. Those algorithms are not the best uh, that they could be and there is a lot more room for improvement. So for new miners and for even experienced miners, NiceHash is still the best and it completely destroys every other miner that we compare it to. So thank you guys for watching this video, let me know what you think about it down in the comments and if you actually found something else that is more profitable than NiceHash. See you soon and bye.